Hey everyone. Diabetes may be the biggest problem the United States has today as a healthcare issue. And I've said in some of my other videos, 50% of, of the population, half the population is going to either be diabetic or pre-diabetic. And that's what I want to talk to you about, this pre-diabetic situation. You know, there's been a couple of studies that have been done, and one of them showed that only 7% of the population realizes that they're pre-diabetic. Just 7%. You know how many millions of people are out there that don't know that they are pre-type 2 diabetes? And only about a third of people of those 7% were actually counseled by their health care provider on steps that they could take to prevent or reverse this disease. You've got to get this information. You've got to find out if you have prediabetes because there's only a window of about three to six years and then you're going to get diabetes. That's it. Here's what you can do to lower your risk of getting this disease. Number one, weight loss. Well, everybody talks about weight loss, right? But it's not that much. If you're 200 pounds to lower your risk, all you have to lose is between 10 and 20 pounds at the most, five to 7% of your weight. You can do it and you must do it. The second thing you need to do is to change your diet. Cut down the fats and the carbs and control the calories that you take. We have other videos that are going to address all of the information about that kind of lifestyle change. And the third thing you need to do is to exercise. It's not a lot. 30 minutes a day, five days a week. And you know, you don't have to do it all at once. You can take some time when you go to the store, you can park further from the grocery store, you can walk up the steps instead of taking the escalator, or even walking up the escalator. Continue to do little things 30 minutes, five days a week. If you do these things, and according to an article that came out in The Lancet in 2009, you can reduce the risk of getting diabetes by a minimum of 34% just by lifestyle changes. If you can't change your lifestyles, and I know that you can, but if for some reason you cannot or think you cannot, talk with your doctor, talk with the diabetes counselor. There's also medications that you can take, one in particular called metformin, which can lower your blood glucose level and help you reduce it. Not as much as lifestyle changes, but still reduce your risk of developing diabetes uh, a significant amount. So remember, you can prevent diabetes when it's pre-diabetes and reverse that situation back to normal.